We've seen how variables can drive sketch dimensions and feature parameters. Variables also can drive linear or angular spacing dimensions, as well as instance counts in patterns. When creating a pattern in a part studio or assembly, the spacing is defined with a length dimension or an angle. A variable may be used for the spacing value. However, both linear spacing and angular spacing values possess units. If the variable is defined as a length or angle type, it can be used to define the respective length in a linear pattern or angle in a circular pattern. If using a variable type of number or any, and units have not been defined, the units are automatically added after the variable is assigned to the parameter. The number of instances within a pattern is defined with a unitless number. A variable that drives the instance count must also be unitless. If a variable is defined as a length or angle type, it has units and cannot be used to define the instance count in a pattern. The variable must be defined as a number or any value. The spacing and instance count in a linear or circular sketch pattern may also be defined with variables. Another interesting option in OnShape, since variables are features in the feature list, they can also be used as inputs to pattern. Using a combination of expressions and variables, you can achieve variances in a pattern. We will learn more about this in future videos.